Hey everybody, it's Steve. Today we're going to talk about how to put photos from your photo gallery onto your Apple Watch. And that is possible now because the Apple Watch has received the Watch OS 2 update. And so you can put custom watch faces from your photo gallery. And let's get into how to do that right now. What I did was in my photo gallery, I created an album called Watch. And within that, I have some watch faces that I like and would like to use as watch faces for my Apple Watch. So, from there, you saw my album with uh, watch faces. You don't have to create one with watch faces. You can choose anything you want. So that's not you know very critical, what you name it. I just did that for the sake of ease for myself. So from there, we're going to go into the Apple Watch app. We're going to go into Photos. And you can see right now, there's Synced Albums. Sync, uh, synced Album. And right now it's on Favorites, even though my Favorites album is empty. And there is the Watch album that I created with the pictures I want for my watch. So, actually, let me just pull back for a second. I need to unlock the watch. So right now I'm just using the um, extra large watch face, which is one of the standard issue watch faces. So now let's go over to the photos. So let me zoom in a little bit. You can see it says, there it is photo, no photos, to sync photos, choose an album from the Apple Watch app on your iPhone. Now I could have, you know, when I first went into the um, synced albums, I could have automatically just, you know, chosen the um, album that I wanted, but I'm just doing this for illustrative purposes. So there is the no photos. So let's just tap on that. And there it is. So obviously we want to get a picture on there. So at this point, you could just tap on the, let me focus the camera a little bit, the watch album right there. That's the one we want to sync. And it takes a few seconds. And there we go. So now if I want to change that picture, what I could do is I'll press and hold, customize, I'm oh, sorry about that light glare. And then by using the crown, you can zoom in and zoom out of your pictures. Now in this case, because there wasn't many pictures in the album, it limits the amount it will zoom out. But if you had an album with, let's say, you know, 50, 60 pictures in it, you could zoom out much further and get, get much smaller thumbnails. But in this case, because there wasn't many pictures, it's only going to zoom out but a limited amount, because the rest of the time it allows you to scroll with your finger and choose the picture you want. So in this case, I will pick that apple right there. And I like that. I like the way it's zoomed in and how it's set. Let's see if I can move it a little bit. And I like the way that looks. So I'm going to set that. Now, obviously, um, with this, the only complications available are the built-in uh, date and time. That's all you could do. No weather, no sunrise, sunset, nothing else. That's it. So if you want to change that, you just press and hold customize and again it'll stay on the picture from there but you'll use the digital crown for the zooming and then you could scroll and find whatever picture you want to use tap it set it and you're good to go so that's how you set a custom watch face on your Apple watch when you update to watch OS 2. Okay, if there's any questions, uh, please feel free to you know leave it in the comments or anything else you'd like to know or have any questions about, please feel free to ask that too. And that's it, and thank you for watching.